Welcome back to the Kimi Kato Show. You were listening to Light and Heavy and now Stars Falling from the album Stars Falling, which was released in 2016. And we have our get, as our guest, Masatakumi, a Grammy-winning multi-instrumentalist uh, from Japan. Hello. And Thank yeah, you. it's so such an honor to have you on our show. Thank you so much. You are joining us from Tokyo, Japan. Yes. Today. Thank you. Can you tell us? How's that black tea kicking in? <laughs> it's morning there, right? <laughs> green, green tea. Green tea. Green tea. Yeah, it's green tea. Morning. Even better, huh? Yeah. But it depends better. on our listener. Uh, yeah, it's going to be changed, though. The time <laughs> difference is 16 hours from LA, from the Kimikato. Yes. Right? So it's the own. following day there. Yes. Yeah, yes. wow. we're we're I think we're just about going to our time of starting to drinking uh, to to drink some no, beer, yeah. but it's, it should be sake. Hour, no? <laughs> yeah, <or> sake. Yeah, <laughs> uh, Masa, can you tell us about uh, the the album Stars Falling that oh. you released in two thousand sixteen? Yes, two thousand sixteen. This is uh, my first uh, solo album. I composed all songs in L.A. And then uh, recorded at the Capitol recording studio at the Hollywood, and then shoot my um, my music video there as well. So it's kind of my portfolio. It's a very important album to yeah go to to head to the, my biggest dream. Amazing. Um... It's it's amazing that you recorded the album in LA, and so you know now when I listen to Stars Falling, I would rem I would think about you being in LA, mm. um, which would be interesting because you know, it has a lot of essence, uh, different kind of essence in the in the music. Mm -hmm. But when when I composed that song, I didn't uh, think to blend any Japanese mm. traditional instruments yet mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. because yeah if I achieve my dream everyone I, in my opinion though, everyone try to uh, listen to the, my first album what is yeah this artist of first motivation so I then I think it's a very important album to go back to the, my history so mm -hmm. that is, yeah. Actually, this is my ideal music type. So even if I don't use uh, uh, any, some uh, traditional instruments, no, no matter which instruments, uh, my music is not going to be changed, but this is my original yeah, mm. type of music. Well, I think... It's it's very piano based. Ah uh, yeah yeah. Uh, keyboard. I I think it's beautiful. Um, it, it might be boring from from the some people, but this is my it's kind of naked music. Mm -hmm. And then I can change the instruments depends on the song, depends on the situation time. But this is my yeah. How to say the original songs? Mm. I don't think it's boring. Yeah yeah. <laughs> I think, no, I think it's, not at all. Beautiful. Yeah, but, yeah, but it's, it's very hard to get the attention from the U.S. people because this is a very Western, Eastern mm. music. Yeah, yeah, it's kind of. I I saw I was reading about your about you and yet that when you were a kid you were inspired by Yoshiki. Is that, yeah, that yeah, amazing? Yeah. Oh, I'm I've, so happy that you, you know Yoshiki. I do know Yoshiki. I've been I've been able to meet him a couple times and hang out. Oh. Seen a few of his concerts. Awesome. Um. As his guest, but uh, have you played? Have you worked with him yet? I, I was I, wondering. Once, once I uh, wrote a song for the K-pop artist, and then he produced, and then he wrote the uh, lyrics on it. Mm. Yeah, two thousand four. Cool. The way before oh, wow. the uh, K-pop, it's kind of Era. stream. Yeah. Mm. Oh wow. Mm. Way before though. Yeah, that is my first uh, work. With, yeah, Yoshiki. Yoshiki-san. Was that a dream come true? I imagine. Yeah. For you? 
<laughs> so honored. All, yeah. all the time when I went to the karaoke, I I I put in that song and then the lyricist and then composer is next to the him. All the time I took a picture and then I couldn't believe it yet. Oh, that's crazy. <laughs> that's crazy now. Uh I I love some of you know I love I love I, I do I do kind of hear in some the of the song? songs some of the songs that you play I can't remember which song but you are you do have some influence from Yoshiki sure sure everything <laughs> <laughs> yeah you do it's I do easy. hear it and Obvious. because I th the, the yes your the melody that you create mm. from the mm -hmm. piano yeah has a lot of that beautiful melody that kind of is that i feel that you've been inspired by someone like yoshiki yeah when i was in junior high school i was so influenced by his melody first and then later on uh some uh backing track but at first the melody so that's why the melody is most important thing in my the music life but then you went on to become a drummer uh, yeah because of he's a drummer <laughs> <laughs> and then he composed uh, after uh, after I know that he composed all songs, almost all songs. And then I start to compose and then try to play the piano, even though I didn't have a piano in my home. So all the oh, time, wow. yeah, played at the school. Wow. So yeah. Where did you learn how to play the piano? Not yet. Actually, oh. yeah, I wasn't trained. So, yeah. Not just about to play uh, at the school. Oh, when did you, what age did you start playing the piano then? Actually, I didn't, I haven't started to play the piano. It's so strange though. Even now, I have a piano mm -hmm. on the back. But I, I just play it as I like. It's not practice. Yeah. Oh, wow. Freestyle. Yeah, and self-taught. Wow, incredible! Because I've seen you play, um, and you can pretty much play anything. <laughs> yeah, it's it's kind of play. I can play it by ear, but I'm not good with uh, reading a score faster. Oh, wow. Yeah, like a piano player. That's amazing. I, I I don't know how how to play Explain the piano. It. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, no, I know I know you can play the piano. I know, I, I know you've been modest by saying I don't know how to play the piano. You do know how to play the piano. It's it's almost like you play it as if you own, you know, you you kind of you're in in one piece with the piano. You're you're like intact with it. Um I thought that you were you learned how to play. You were um, no, you, no. you were trained. Basically trained. No, yeah. But, yeah. Or, or, my, you know, my, mm -hmm. Yeah, my first instrument is drum. Drums. So because I debuted, um, mm -hmm. yep. yeah, with the two guys called the Silent. When I was a drama, and then composed the music, I really want to debut as a drama because of mm -hmm. him. Yeah. Oh, because of Yoshiki. So it's, it was, <laughs> so for Masa, it was everything about Yoshiki. He was a drama, so he became, so early, Masa became a drama. And then I think the early twenty ages. Like we we all musicians should do the rock or some heavy music because mm -hmm. there's no no time to play other than the early twenties. In my opinion, if I turn thirty, I thought my music style and then my way of thinking will be changed. So mm. I really wanna how to say I wanna be done. I wanted to be done. The oh, rock drumming, right? In the early twenties. Right. Experience it when you had that youth and that everything that comes with youth, right? That yes, yes. That energy. anger, angst, the anxiety, younger, it's the younger yeah. energy. Yeah, yeah. Because yeah, you lose that. That's true. I hadn't thought about that. What an interesting way to look at that. I want to. I want to dedicate my rock heart to the twenties, and then I turn to be a producer and a composer as I expected. So, yeah, yeah. Oh, hey, Kimmy, we should take another break here. Just 
to get another opportunity to listen to Masa's beautiful music here. Yes, please. What are we what are we doing next? So I'm Masa, what are we to... gonna play next? Are we gonna play the, the yeah, Grammy sure. winning song Sakura? Sakura? Cherry Bro song. Yep. Okay. All right. I love so, this. It's like the three of us hanging out listening to, to records and listening to the yeah. music. <laughs> so okay. the next song is Sakura from the album, the Grammy winning album. Sakura. You're listening to the Kimmy Kato show. We'll be right back. <laughs> 